who I feel really benefits from that in this venue is Venya. He's even Venya in Smash loves, Four. Like Venya would like, like by theory alone, Venya would just love this game. Exactly. So if you ask him exactly. about this game, he'd be like, "Oh, Green Ninja's the best he's ever been." You see oh. his tweets about it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go. We got uh, uh we got Mr. E rocking the Marth. I love it. Seto used to play Meta Knight in mm -hmm. Smash. Oh, right. Ooh, I was playing Big Chungus over here. <laughs> <laughs> Big Chungus. <laughs> Big Chungus. That cast. was a weird hitbox on the uh, Incineroar upbeat. It kind of turned Marth around, so he didn't even get to counter it. Yeah. But I can see this being pretty bad for Incineroar. And he's been a while. He's been here for a while. Like, he's playing in, like, since the Brawl days. Always playing Marth. And that's the thing. With, uh, with these sorties, against, like, grapplers, if you don't understand the matchup, you can get bodied really fast for swinging when you're not supposed to. Uh, Mr. E being one of the marks who is really good at spacing his swings, letting them, putting out hitboxes right before he hits the ground. So I don't see him struggling in this matchup. He's also really good at tra ledge traffic too. Oh, oh my God. If that if that was like Krom's would be like, they would have like taken him with him. That would have been, that'd be a nice buff for the character. That's just, that's just <laughs> that just sucks. He just goes that, right through you. It actually has a hit, uh, a spike box at the top. I think Mr. E a bead. So it went, uh, oh, so it went just straight like, through okay. it. Yeah. I think he did that on purpose, which is oh really my God, smart. That shield is done. Okay. Puts him in the air. I like I wanna, it. Okay. Knowing that the clothesline wouldn't kill from there, he decides to just launch him in the air. But still at a disadvantage right now because he's got hit. Yeah. Takes full stage control to Mr. E. The nice cross up on the fair. The footstool. All oh, this character. All oh, this recovery. It's so bad. Oh, my heart. Now, clothesline, not going to do it yet. Revenge would have bodied him, though. I like it. This is Cinderella, Wasted not playing bad. Never. But Mr. E, just, he's on top of it. He's on top of every option, Yikes. on the text, on everything. Just immediately up B's, too, just to hit him. Just to, just to like, make him waste his jump there just to try to get back. Was yep. Pretty smart, too. Just, he just mashed out of that situation. Yeah. He, he still got the kill for it. That's the thing with these heavies, like the K, well, not K rule, but like DK and Incineroar, all these heavy grapplers, like on the stage, like they're scary. They're really scary. Like if um, if Aceto's able to revenge a couple of moves, hit him, get him to 80, 90%, like Mr. E needs to be afraid. But Mr. E's so good at waiting those out, playing the neutral really hard, getting him off the stage, and then just capitalizing every single time. Right. He got him off the stage four times, three times, he died. Mm. And that's all he needs. But Incineroar also needs like a small amount of hits in order, in order to take the stocks back too. This is rough when the character he's fighting right now has a disjoint and it's faster than him. Exactly. And he just died. Incredible. That's just like mm. that. We literally just started the match. One and that's one disadvantage state. That's how these top players keep winning and stay consistent. They capitalize on disadvantage. It's like if they know the character has a weak recovery, they will just like just kill you in six seconds. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. We got a little bit of traction for a settle. Let's see what he's able to do with it. Opting to keep the middle of the stage. I like it. He's got oh. three stocks to take. Mm -hmm. this here we go. Disadvantage. Pass. Let's see if he can make it back. Like right there. Oh my. Okay. Oh, okay. Save this jump, thankfully. Yeah. But good job. The stage fight. So Ooh. smart. Ooh. He he baited out the side B. I mean, he probably needed the side B anyways. Was able to avoid it and then clipped him before the up B came out. So he had to take it. Down two, Ooh, that down is forward true. air. That's true, and it yeah. kills right near the ledge because down by like, forward air is knocked back is incredibly strong. And he needs that. So like, any hit this character can get is like he just needs it. So, like, Look at this. Mr. E's uh, hitbox placement so good, man. Like, I can't even imagine playing against this wall. Oh, is that? Oh, what a sick <laughs> gimp. That's a sick, like, that's a, that's a gimp that Cinema can do. Like, just like... Oh, no jump. Yeah, he needed to do that. Oh, yeah, no jump. Right. Yeah, but about that Gimp, though, it was just like... Yeah, that was really good. has that against people who try to chase him with that, yeah. like, very low. Mm -hmm. If you don't space that out right, you're getting grabbed. Yeah, it's unfortunate about this character, though. Mm -hmm. it's the weakness of him just recovering that way. I mean, watching that match, you'll say that Incineroar is the worst character in the game. It looks like, like it. He looks uh, like it. Mr. E just didn't allow Incineroar to do what Incineroar does.